Got a 2006 F-150 with four-wheel drive here. I'm going to be changing the front wheel bearing. So with the wheel off, the first step for us is to remove this rotor and the caliper. This caliper bracket is held on with an 18 millimeter, with two 18 millimeter bolts. What the hell? So we'll put a different size bolt in the top. I'm just gonna let this dangle here. It's fine. You don't need to wire it up, it's just a conspiracy. Uh, next thing to come off, you wanna trace back the ABS. The new part I have comes with an ABS sensor already. There's the line. You trace it up, it comes up into here. There's the connector. Can you see that? Can you see that connector? I don't know how much of that you saw, but there's the connector. I got that free. Now what I'm going to do is pop this little cover off. See what's waiting there for me. Thirteen millimeter for that little axle. This is the axle nut. Right? I'm gonna be hammering on this. I don't want to mess up the threads of the axle, so I'm gonna leave this nut face. It's gonna be flush with the face here. All right, that's loose. She's ready to go. All right. Now all that remains is uh, there's four 18 millimeter bolts that come in from the back side. I'm gonna make you short again. So yeah, like I said, 18 millimeter. Oh, that's tough, man. I'm going to rotate this so I can get to the bolts on the other side. There we 
go. Now the only thing holding this in now is some rust. Some of that Detroit rust. It's good stuff. That's that, you got that out. Got our new part here. It's looking pretty good. Pull this little cap out. There's the sensor. The sensor part here goes on the left side. There's a cap in the back too. Right, sitting in there. Now, when you put these four bolts back in there, you don't want to crank them on down. You don't want to get them real tight on one side before you get them tight on the other side. So you want to get it started. Get them all started and then tighten them evenly. So I've got that one snug. I'm gonna do the opposite one. Now what we want to do is route this. You want to be gentle with this line. You want to hear that good positive click. The click is what you want. A little tip. Use a lug nut. Throw it on the bottom. That'll keep the rotor from flopping out like that. That's it, the wheel bearing's on there. Gotta line this up. Hold. 